Hello my people, welcome to the SCORE channel and welcome to the city of Milwaukee, Wisconsin. Today we're going to be checking out a small school that does one thing extremely well. That's the Milwaukee School of Engineering, MSOE, located right here in downtown Milwaukee. Is it a right fit for you? Let's find out. As always, I sat down with someone in the admissions office. Today, we're talking to Samantha Cammers to learn a little bit more about MSOE and to find out exactly if their programs are right for you. Um, my name is Samantha Cammers. I'm the director of non-traditional admissions at the Milwaukee School of Engineering. MSOE is an undergraduate engineering institution primarily. MSOE is a top 10 undergraduate engineering university in the US. We are ranked number nine when it comes to undergraduate engineering, so that is what we really focus on and that's what we really specialize in. Some of those include civil engineering, computer engineering, and our most popular mechanical engineering program. And a few others among those are ranked in the top 10 in the US. In a lot of ways, MSOE is the exact opposite of a liberal arts college. Primarily, you are going to focus on engineering courses here. If you know that you wanna be an engineer, I can't think of a better place for you. We are a direct entry school. So if you think of some other universities, especially with engineering and nursing in the US, sometimes we have what's called pre-engineering engineering or pre-nursing and students will have to take sometimes two years of general education classes and then they have to apply again to get into their program of their choice. When you are admitted into MSOE you're also admitted into your program right away and you start taking those very specific program classes within your very first quarter. And we have over 600 hours of lab time throughout your four years of study meaning that students have a lot of hands-on experience, they have a lot of individual attention from their professors, and they have really small class sizes because MSOE overall is a very small institution. We have just under 3,000 students on campus. All of our facilities are very specific to the majors that we teach. So each of our programs has its own area on campus where we have state-of-the-art labs and classrooms, um, facilities that really have all of the tools and the machines that are specific to that major. We also have a brand new supercomputer on campus for our computer science and software engineering students. And this was actually fully donated by one of our alumni, Dwight Derricks, Vice President of NVIDIA. Even though at a lot of other schools, this is a graduate level type machine, we allow our undergraduate students to use it. Even though the word engineering is right there in the name, Milwaukee School of Engineering also has a really good nursing program with some state-of-the-art facilities right there on campus. The location is great. Downtown Milwaukee gives you the sensation that you're in a big city because if you look around you, you are. But it's also not as big of a city as say Chicago or New York, so you'll find that things are a little more affordable and accessible. MSOE is just a few blocks away from historic sites, cultural buildings, and of course, Milwaukee is totally known for its beer and brats, and I'm making sure to get some before I get out of here. There's a lot of things to do. It's a really fun area. There's a lot of restaurants to go to. We have a lot of museums. We have a lot of festivals. Really, you can walk just about anywhere you need to within the MSOE area. We have Lake Michigan. That's about a 20, 25 minute walk away. So there's always a lot of things to do in the downtown area. While I was on campus, I was able to talk to a couple of students too to hear what they have to say about MSOE. Hi, my name is Ayush Patel. I'm a junior construction management major at the Milwaukee School of Engineering University. My name is Michael Petroff. I'm a senior dual degree student for the architectural engineering program with a focus in structural engineering. I transferred my majors into construction management mainly because I wanted to be more hands-on in the field and I've always had a drive for engineering of a sense and being able to help people build things that they need for their communities, whether it be hospitals, schools, or educational public facilities. So I came to MSOE as a transfer student my freshman year. Um, I transferred from a different school and then transferred into the architectural engineering program, um, mostly just for the degree. And then I'm also a student athlete here, so it helped having the coaching staff that was here. And how do you feel that MSOE has prepared you so far? I think it's prepared me more than I could ever imagine and hope for, really. Um, I've had multiple internships through the school of my faculty helping me prepare. Our classes are far more than um, helpful enough to prepare us for our real world experiences. I have gone into my internships as well as just interviews with professionals in industry and been more than prepared to answer whatever questions they need or talk to industry professionals who I'm not working with and hold a good conversation and make professional connections. So basically you feel prepared because um, I don't know, when you're in meetings and stuff and you say you're from MSOE, like, they just know that you're already prepared. They, they know that the MSOE kids come in ready. They never worry about us. They know we're ready to go. The experience here, what are some of the highlights for you? Probably one of my favorite places on campus is the dorms. 
um, you will see and experience and meet all sorts of people, all sorts of experiences and new things that you never thought you would have gotten the chance to do or see or be able to meet really. Um, and I think it's one of my favorite things on campus, getting to be friends and meet so many people every single day. Really. So I'm a student athlete on the men's basketball team here. Um, so we're an NCAA Division III university so we can compete in all of the championships that they run. Um, it's a really cool experience. Uh, it's a step up. It keeps you competitive and then kind of keeps you focused on school as well when you got to worry about all your teammates and everything going on. So it's a lot of fun. So any advice for applicants? Yeah, don't be afraid to talk to everyone. Everyone here is willing to help, whether it's a faculty member or another student you're walking past. Don't be afraid to get involved and ask a bunch of questions because the more questions you ask, the more you're going to learn. One tip I would give is if it gets hard, don't quit stick it out, try and really get through the tough time. The school can be a little bit difficult, but if you put in the hard work and dedication, you'll get the payoff more than you can imagine. A lot of universities, you will be working against classmates to get job opportunities and into departments, while at MSOE, it's really a team, so learning how to work with others along with yourself as well is a really hard task for a lot of people, so learning who you are and how to work for yourself is my biggest tip. These guys are great examples of the kind of students that Samantha told me about. So what kind of student is MSOE looking for? An ideal candidate for MSOE would be a student who is very good at math and science, um, who has a passion for engineering, has a passion for learning, a creative thinker, and somebody who's ready for the academic challenge of MSOE. We are looking for a 3.0 cumulative GPA. Someone who is in at least pre-calculus, if not calculus, is usually a very successful student at MSOE. First thing we require is a free application on our website. It only takes about 10 minutes to complete the application, so it's very easy to do. But when it comes to testing, we are test optional, so we don't require the ACT or the SAT for admission. If you are admitted to MSOE, that's when we will also need to see financial documents. For international students, the financial aid packages at MSOE are actually really competitive. As it is, the tuition at MSOE isn't nearly as high as other private universities, and the quality of the education you're going to get for engineering makes it an incredibly good value compared to other universities for the same program. When we're looking at the total price, it's around $62,000 per year. So that includes your tuition, living expenses, and health insurance. And we do have a very large merit scholarship that we give to all of our accepted international students. This scholarship is a $25,000 per year scholarship. There are a few other scholarships you can earn if you've participated in World Robotics, FIRST Robotics, or any type of engineering course in your high school. This is a $3,000 additional scholarship. You can speak with our financial aid office to see if there are any additional opportunities for scholarship. When you add in the financial aid that international students can get up front, you can get a really good deal on your degree at MSOE. MSOE is proof that small schools can do big things, and that's one of the reasons why I wanted to cover this place. I think a lot of times we focus on big universities when we want to do big things, but you can make yourself an expert in a small school that does this one thing really, really well, and I think that's why MSOE could be a good fit for a lot of students. I want to thank you for listening to me talk about MSOE. Um, again, I do encourage you to apply. It is free to apply on our website. If you have any additional questions, you can also reach out to me. We are on a rolling admission, so that means we don't have an application deadline. But I do encourage you to apply by September, October, November of the previous year before you plan on enrolling. Again, reach out to me if you have any questions, and thank you. I'd like to give a big thank you to Samantha Cameras for taking some time to talk to me today and a big thank you to MSOE for having us and if you guys like this and you want to see more university episodes subscribe to the channel because we are going to be covering more universities for you we're also really excited right now to be celebrating a bunch of our admits we have gotten a ton of acceptance letters from score students from the last year's admission cycle and we're putting them up on our Instagram so you can check us out at prep with score we really are proud of everybody who's made it in so far, and we hope that you could be one of those people too. If you'd like some support with your application to MSOE or to any other university that you're thinking of, you can hit us up at prepwithscore.com to learn more how we can help you. So I'm gonna go enjoy Milwaukee's famous beer and bratwurst, and I will see you next week.